Welcome to this installment of Capstan Ag's video series. I'm Sam Marks and today we'll be learning how to check a pressure sensor to ensure that it is working properly. Today we are going to go over how to properly diagnose a pressure sensor. If your pressure is not reading on your gauge on your display, it may be as simple as a bad pressure sensor. To perform this test, we'll need a digital multimeter set to DC volts. We'll need this breakout harness and then your system pressure sensor on your boom. Now first, we unplug the system pressure sensor and plug in this breakout harness. Take your positive lead and put it in the white wire on the breakout harness and your negative lead to the black wire. Now this is a 0.5 to 5 volt pressure sensor, 0 to 100 PSI. So at 0.5 volts, we should be right around 0 PSI. At 100 PSI, we'll be at 5 volts. And in between that is a range between 0.5 and 5. So around 50 PSI, which is halfway, we should see 2.75 volts. So as I increase pressure, you can see that voltage change. As I decrease pressure, that voltage drops down. If your voltmeter does not change or if it has one constant setting, that is a likely case that your pressure sensor has gone bad. Now you know how to properly diagnose a pressure sensor. Thanks for learning with us today from everybody at Capstan Ag. For more information, contact our team at capstanag.com.